the single arm dumbbell press from hip bridge. Phenomenal exercise for still building up the upper body strength. We're pressing with the chest, the shoulder, and the tricep. But now we are incorporating more of the full body. Very specifically, we're engaging the core from a rotational standpoint. We're getting the hips much more engaged so that as we develop strength in the upper body, we're also tying it into how the body stabilizes us during that motion. So the way we're going to set it up is we're going to use a small box around 12 to 14 inches. And you're going to set yourself so that the kind of bottom of your shoulder blades, think about where you would wear a bra, that bra strap area is going to be set up against that box. When I set my feet up for an optimal position, if I lay my legs straight, I'm going to take one heel and line it up with the opposite knee. Bring the other foot to match. Now I know when I come to the top, I'm going to have a nice 90 degree in the knees, and that's what I'm looking for. My feet are just wider than my hips, but feel free to make a little adjustment if need be. Now, we want to protect our shoulder. So I am going to use that opposite hand to help you position that dumbbell up to the leg. And then as I flex my glutes to bridge up, that other hand is going to help find me in position. I position myself so that I'm at the far end of the box so that if my elbow does want to get deeper, it can. My other hand is going to make a fist and press down across the box to help with that stability. Arm is driving, butt is flexing, belly is braced. And then from here, I'm going to pull that dumbbell down to me, building that tension in the body. When I feel that tension get to its peak, I'm going to press to the top. The rest of my body remains stable and strong. When I'm done, I'm going to bring it in tight to my body and back down to my leg to protect my shoulder. Give it a whirl.